Is that it? <sighs> so I did this game around about eight years ago on Android called Repton. When I say it was called Repton, it was actually a copy of a game called Repton, which originally came out on the BBC Micro, a computer from the 80s, 8-bit computer from the 80s. And I think this game, I believe, was exported to other computers, possibly the Spectrum, maybe the 64, I'm not entirely sure. And also it went onto a PC version. And I decided I quite liked it. There was an iPhone version of Repton, which looked pretty much like this one. And I decided to do an Android version and contact, uh, once it was done, to actually contact the publisher of the of the iPhone game and the original publisher of the BBC Micro game it was as, it was as well. And I did it because I was actually getting into programming for Android at the time, I was enjoying it. So I did it as a task, as a test, just to give me something to cut my teeth on. So I wrote it and I thought I'd contact the company that was doing the iPhone version. And I did so. And as I said, the company that was doing the iPhone version was the original company that did the 8-bit one back in the 80s as well. And it is actually a, a complete version of this game called Repton, if anybody knows it. And it does everything that that version did. In fact, this is playing levels from the original version because it uses actually the original level data. I wrote it so it could read the original level data so that I just had to do the graphics and programming the behaviors for the, and programming the behaviors for the various characters and how the game physics worked, how the physics engine worked. So I did all that and then all I had to do is read in various levels and I got the entire game. So I did that and it worked fine and everything. It was a, when I say it, it's 100% complete as regards the game engine. It just needed a, a few extra tweaks on the Android interface, and that was about it. It was always like 90%, if not a bit more, complete. And yeah, it was a good task. I enjoyed actually coding this in Android. So I contacted the publisher, and I actually sent a link to this video. And yeah, I mean, very kindly walked back, wasn't ignored, but said at the time that, oh, don't worry about it, sorry, don't need this. There is an Android version in development coming up. And I kept an eye on the Android Play Store for, for some years. As I say, this was about eight years ago, so about 2010, and it never really appeared. And when I did a search just um, a minute or two ago, I find out that actually, yeah, there was a version one of Repton release, which is the very first early version of Repton, in March 2016. So yeah, six years after I'd initially authored it, it was eventually published on Android. And I think my version is pretty good anyway. So if you've got an Android, there's a Repton 1 and there's a Repton 3. It's less than two years ago, so it took them some time to, to release it, whatever reason. They didn't want my version, but I was pretty proud of it. But obviously, for whatever reason, they didn't want to go ahead and publish anything on Android. And we just sort of, rather than saying that was, I presume rather than saying that, I was just saying that there was one development to be coming out soon. But I just thought you'd like to see that. It's something I worked on, let's say it was about eight years ago now, just for a bit of fun. I can't release it. I would never release it. It's not my copyright release this game has all the original PC graphics the game concept the name everything it's just I've put it up now uh, just to show you what I'd done several years ago hope you enjoyed that bye for now